In this video, we're going to come up with the parametric equations to describe to describe this path. So, uh, so you've got one circle, one small circle of radius three, and a big circle of radius five. We are trying to keep track of one particular point on the big circle, on the green circle. So, as the two circles rotate, it's going to trace out this path. Our task is to come up with the parametric equations to describe this path. So let me illustrate it with an animation. So we are trying to keep a track of this this uh, this particular point on the green circle. So as as the two circles rotate, it's going to trace out this path. Okay. So hang on. So notice that um, one cycle one cycle which is two pi one cycle would take us to would take us to here. Hang on. One cycle would take us to here. Now this is one cycle. Let me start again. So this is one cycle. Two pi will take us to here. The reason why it takes us to six pi is because the radius of the uh, of the small circle is three. So it takes us to um, to six pi. So you you do need this three here. So um, so play around with it. Load up decimals. I will put in the description uh, below. But load up decimals and punch this in. That will then give us. Um, that will then allow you to. Uh, hang on. That will then allow you to slide the circle back and forth. So, uh, so punch this in. This will describe um, what the, uh, the the dots here as it rotates. And we've done this in the um, in the previous video. So now, as you rotate it, it will give you this. But you do need this three here. This three is very very important. If you don't have that three, it will look like this. Hang on. If you don't have that three, it will look like it will look like this thing here. So hang on, if you don't have that three, so here we don't have a three here. Uh, we don't have a three here. If you don't have that three, it will look like this. So one, si one cycle should take us to six pi, but if you don't have that three, it will take us to here. Hang on. This is one cycle right now. If you don't have that three, it will take you to here. You do need that three, otherwise, it's, um, otherwise all hell will break loose. Because if, if you look at this thing here, this, this thing here, will describe this dot. If you don't have that three, let me get rid of this three here. It, and then and then and then illustrate it. Hang on. Let me get rid of the uh, the other two here. If you don't have that three, it's gonna look something like this. We we are trying to keep track of this dot here, this red dot. If you don't have that three, it's gonna look like this. So it's all strange. Um you you do need this three here and that, that's a reason why um, so just play around with it and try and figure out for that reason for yourself. Um, the, the reason is you you want you want this circle to tie up with um, with, with the angle. Well, it's hard to explain. Um, play around with it and try and figure it out for yourself. But you do need that three. Okay. I will continue in the next video.